It was crazy. Just out of nowhere. Boom! The whole car was totaled. Hold on a second. It's the doctor. Margaret? What? Could you send in Peggy to send in Todd Francis? My three o'clock. Thank you. Mr. Francis, the doctor will see you now. You wouldn't believe it, Marge. No insurance. He's just a psycho. Doctor, thanks so much for having me on such short notice. No My problem, Mr. Todd. Francis. Sit down, please. I think we should discuss the nature of the beast right now. Well, uh, every time I sit down to try and draw something pretty, everything comes out ugly. All I've been doing lately is uh, drawings and paintings of diseases, horrible parasites, uh, animals attacking their handlers. Uh, worst of all, they'll sit down and try and do something beautiful, and it comes out ugly, and there's a pigeon in the middle of it, Doc. Uh-huh. What's your earliest childhood memory? Let's see, I remember being about one year, one and a half. Yeah. Uh, I lived in a place that had some stairs. Milk. Eggs. Ooh, I need socks. Ah, must get the Cocoa Puffs. Ah, Cocoa Puffs. He's still going. How much time of my life have I spent just listening to garbage? I should have been a bartender. Honestly, Doc, life is really tough right now, and I don't know where to go anymore. I don't know who to turn to. I, honestly, I just, I need someone to hold my hand. Save that noise for square dancing. Hold your own hand. I'm telling you, Doc, I got problems. I'm, I'm here for a reason. I'm trying to solve these problems. I'm here for your help. Well, what I do have is an alternative treatment, if you're willing to try. I'm willing to try anything, Doc. Let me have it. Well, I'll give it to you. Just relax. I'd like you to count backwards from five. Five, four. Lisa, Todd will be coming out. Could you bill him for a full session? Thank you. You're free to go, Todd. 